So this is the Endeavor Robotics uh, 710 Cobra. Uh, typically we have a, a two-link arm for EOD application, but this is a modular robot, so we're able to put on the uh, 240 Golf uh, from Precision Remotes, the weapon station. So putting this particular integration with the uh, Precision, uh, Precision Remotes uh, weapon station, is, uh, as we're seeing in the market, the, uh, the weaponization is actually starting to mature. Uh, within the military, the, the thought of actually going down this path. We've done in the past years, uh, we've done some um, live fire demonstrations at Fort Benning, uh, but it seems like the culmination is coming up now with the, uh, with the military for, for this type of capability. Uh, so this particular capability, uh, because of the size of this, uh, this robot, the, you know, it's one thing to put a, a remote weapon station on any system. You, know, you can put it on a vehicle, you can put it on a larger vehicle. Larger, uh, this actually allows the infantry to have a system that follows them through narrow alleyways, that allows them to go upstairs, uh, you know, remotely control this to go up into a doorway up the stairs and then actually uh, set a support by fire position in a second story window or a rooftop, which you know, becomes a actual extension of the infantry, an extra squad member, uh, you know, an extra machine gun team, uh, but not committing forces to a particularly, uh, you know, dangerous situation.